Over the years, I know that as part of your job, like mine, I, I talk to a lot of famous people, and I think you're very good at sort of becoming friendly with them, and me less so. I've got a couple of friends here and there, but you've got all these famous friends, and uh, I'm always thinking like, oh, is that something that you set out? Did you know that you were just good at making friends? Because I was never good at it. I was never good at just easily making friends, especially with other famous people. I always assume they don't want to talk to me. That's interesting. I mean, I know. I mean, from listening to your podcast, I didn't realize that you had so few friends. I would have thought that... <laughs> I feel like it's... <laughs> now, wait. <laughs> that's not what I said. <laughs> I think it is. I think it is what you said. No, it's like it would just... Uh, yes, okay. I... <laughs> I, yeah, I do get curious when I see other people who are like yourself, who are very good at, like, you meet someone, and I think I get a little self-conscious. You never really? got self-conscious about that. Like, you'll meet, like, a Jennifer Aniston or something and then say, hey, let's go... Let's go get us some sloppy joes, you yeah, know? And, uh... But I'm a real social person. Like, I like to be around people all the time. I think you're a little bit more introverted, and I'm a little bit more extroverted. Um, you know, right? <laughs> no, I, I try really, really hard. <laughs> I think that's what they're picking up on, is I'm like, come on, you want to get a sloppy joe, Jennifer Aniston? <laughs> I think they find that creepy, the that I'm trying so hard, yeah. I, feel, I felt for many years that it was part of the requirement, the job requirement, to be friends with so many people because you have to keep having them back on the show. And there's so, you know, I just felt like it was part of my job. Wow, okay. And it was natural, like, to do that because, right. you know...